I have my leg in, he's flat. Uh, kind of home base for me is figure four, right? Hey guys, I need you to be quiet, okay? Sit up, sit up, good. Home base for me is figure four. So figure four is when I'm able to make a what with my legs? A four, right? Now how I get to this is, is I have something called a hip dip leg curl. Now what a hip dip leg curl is, everybody watch my shoelaces. My shoelaces are on this red line. This represents my leg just got put in. So I tilted, I threw my leg in, he bellies out, and now my knee's out and my leg is in. See how my shoelaces are on this red line? I want to get these shoelaces on this leg. Now, if I just put my shoelaces on the leg like this, it's not very tight. This is a big hole, right? So I do something called a hip dip. Watch, it goes hip dip. See how my left cheek is moving and my right side is staying in the same place. Hip dip, and then what's the next part? Leg curl. Now I curl my shoelaces onto the back of my hamstring. Leg curl. You see how much higher it is on my leg? Right? A lot tighter of a gap for his leg to be in. Right? So all the time it's hip dip, leg curl. Right? Now, kind of like my, my sweet spot is above my, uh, my knee pit up here. If it's a little bit lower and it's in the knee pit, that's fine too. Okay? Just don't be figure four on the calf. That's not a four anymore, that's a scissor. Okay? It's not illegal, but we don't want to scissor the leg. We want to be above the knee pit or higher. Okay? So, he's flat. I have my leg angle flat. Right? Hip dip leg curl. Hip dip down. I leg curl out of my hamstring. Okay? She lays it on the hamstring. Everybody see that? Now, a lot of us, put your leg down for one second. A lot of us are going to have your leg up in the air like this. This is not good wrestling. What's illegal is when I go over the back of his leg like this, you're at, they'll actually call potentially damage. You can't do that. So what I do is I have my leg and it's straight. And not only is it straight, but my knees are off the back. Everybody see my straight leg knee right now? Not my leg knee, but my straight leg knee. Is it touching the mat? No. Absolutely not. Is my leg in knee touching the mat? No. The only thing touching the mat is my elbows right here. That's it. And right now, the only thing touching the mat is my left hand. This is a lot of pressure on his hip, okay? That's, that's what turns him, this pressure. This is no pressure. You gonna say, hey, no more talking. This is no pressure, right? This is no pressure at all. I need to have both knees off the mat and march. Now, I'm gonna show you how to turn the lower half of the body and then the upper half. How I turn the lower half is not one big lunge. It's gonna be a lot of baby hops on my straight leg. It's gonna be hop, 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 hop. Okay, the lower half is open. See how I open his hips up? How I open his, I'm sorry, how I open his hips up is the lower half. At the same time, I have to turn his upper half as well. How we do that is like this. Everybody hold your arm up, and then curl your wrist up like this. You guys see how this looks like a soup plate? That spoon that you get the soup out of, Right, see how it's like one of those super. So I call that a ladle. Now the reason I do this is stay up here. If I have my arm around him, shake your head left and right. Easy, right? But if I ladle his chin like this, right now I kind of catch him in the crook of my wrist. That's where I want to go. I want to ladle his his chin. Now, I, like I said, that guy Mitch Clark came over uh, once a week when I was growing up. Once a week when I was little, and we would just do ladle, ladle, ladle all the time. Have you guys ever been like in a real life setting and you like accidentally do like a wrestling move, like you dab your boy up the street, you're like, yo, what's up? You like, you know, like Russian type, you know what I mean, like one of those? So that would happen sometimes because I did this ladle so often. So I'm at the movies this one time, right? I'm showing the movies, sexy girl next to me, I'm on a date, she's sitting right here. Okay, what her name was like? Billy. Billy? Her name was Billy Eilish. No, it wasn't. Uh, I don't really know a girl named off of Billy. But okay, her name was Billy too. So, I like to move to Billy, and have you guys ever seen in the movies when they do like that yawn technique, you know, like the arm around the shoulder like that? So I was like, oh, you know what? I'm gonna do the yawn shit. I'm like, oh, there you go, baby. I'm gonna do that, right? And I was like, oh, it's gonna be genius, right? I'm gonna put my arm around her. She's gonna think it was an accident. Perfect. So mid-yawn, right, I go into wrestling mode. Because Mitch Clark comes over every single week. We do legs every single week. So I go into wrestling mode. So I'm sitting there. I go mid-yawn. Oh, yeah, you 
put it in a ladle, right? And I just <laughs> lay her face off. She gets up, she leaves, and what am I thinking? But, but no, this works, right? Like this really works. It's a good move. So what's the point of the story? Go flat. Ladle, chin, right? You have to lift them up. Right again, dip, dip, leg curl. I'm on my straight leg. I'm off my knees. As I hop on my straight leg, I need to stop talking, for real. Got it? Okay. As I hop on my straight leg, as I hop on my straight leg, I'm opening his lower half. I'm ladling his chin at the same time. Hop, 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 ladle. See how I'm ladling this? Once I get to about 90 and I'm ripping his face this way, don't football the head. I don't like football in the head. A lot of us are trained to do that. What I like to do is I go to the far shoulder like this, and then imagine like pulling the shoulder and straightening your arm, right? So I'm at the far shoulder, I pull it. See, I pull it and I straighten my arm. Now I can post, you know, be safe from him rolling through. Notice how I'm not on my side like this, right? He, can, I have no post on the other side, he can kind of roll up on me, no good, right? So. I, I always post with this. So once I get here, I post. He rolls into me, right? No harm. I can kind of just crowd the position, take my leg out, and, and step over if I need to. Make sense? So, whole thing. This is going to be a lot of turns in a second. Ready? No, on the base. Jam, he pushes back. I go pull, trade. He's in TV position. I go tight waist, tilt. Leg in, he bellies out, I go hip dip, leg curl. I hop my straight leg at the same time, lay on his face. Hop, 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 hop. I get him to about 90. I go to the shoulder, I pull it, extend it. He's in the swipe city. Any questions? No. Uh, you got it? Okay. Obviously, go ahead and start with the leg in. He's flat first. Start with the figure four. What's up? Show yeah, I'll show the flat part. Start with the figure four, and then do the whole breakdown.